how's it going everyone what is up welcome back to the channel and your daily dose of mortal kombat 11 news leaks and discussions so we're, we're really doing it today man we have another video coming out a little bit later and it's for dragon ball but there's just a lot of shit going on today and like fighting games today and yesterday but we do have some information about an update that's coming next week now i want to go ahead and shout these guys out before we get into all of it this is a conversation from sailings and the thinny over on twitter discussing an update that's coming so i'm going to put both of their twitters in the uh, link in the description down below go check them out sailings is a data miner for mortal kombat about 11 as well and the thingy of course the best data miner in the business go check him out for sure if you guys want to stay up on accurate data mines accurate news when it comes to mortal kombat 11's game files go give both of them a follow i really appreciate it but this is for an update that's probably coming sometime next week now there's a little bit of concerning information that goes into this and i'm going to break it all down because the thingy said it's something to be concerned about so it's more than likely something to be con uh, concerned about and we'll break down what all of this means near the end of the video so we're gonna go ahead and throw it up on the screen and it starts with Salent saying not really a leak but the devs game version has been updated 16 hours ago and the QA team is back on to testing the future update which means it's probably it probably won't be out this month and then the thingy replies uh prod q a means it's gonna be in for next week's update Salent said oh okay so for the 26th the 28th the thing he said, judging by the fact they used uh, underscore backup yesterday, this is bad news. Sailing says, why is that? He said, because that means something was coming, then they had to go back to an old version. He said, when you mean something, you're referring to a simple update or like a combat pack. Literally anything. Oh, okay. Um, okay, so here's what we have to go on. The actual picture here, I'll put it up on the screen. Um... There's not really much that anybody can get out of this unless you're like a data miner. But judging from what the thing he says, this is an update. Uh, and what Sailing says, this is an update that was coming, that is coming within the next week or two. And there might be some issues going on with it right now. Now, as we've talked about over the past week or so, over the past two weeks, we do know that MK11 common sense wise we'll have another combat pack is this going to be the update that actually reveals it all it is entirely possible that we could see characters in the game data files uh when it comes when this update comes out but here's the thing about it uh, i would say it's less le a lot less than likely because usually by now we're getting teases for whatever is coming next in a big way when it came to the combat pack 2 they were teasing us with cobra ed boom was teasing us with cobra we were doing the clues we were doing the videos about the clues break them down and everything else as far as combat pack 3 goes we haven't heard anything really we've got a few very vague possible teases from ed boom but nothing much aside from that they could definitely throw the characters in there as like a big surprise like hey it hasn't been that long so we're not gonna like do clues or any of that bullshit you know here's the reveal surprise there you go that's very very likely impossible but with mk11 being in the state that it's in right now and not being very uh alive or being played there's a lot of people who have dipped out of the scene and need to be brought back by like teases and everything else that's going to reinvigorate the game a little bit and then that's going to re reinvigorate the game heading into a trailer that's going to you know revitalize the game like bring it back to life so um I, while i don't think getting characters in this update like having their names in the data files in this update is very likely it still definitely is possible i think the the thing that we can look forward to the most especially Especially with what happened the other day uh, in the pro competition with Titanium Tigers getting banned from the pro competition for playing Shiva and having the variation name hashtag WagadanRS do this, which is a very fair question when it comes to Shiva and also a good meme. Um, I think they're balancing the game out a little bit because there is some things in the game uh, as far as a competitive level goes right now that's really fucking busted. Uh, we all know this. Sub-Zero's dumb. Shiva's even dumber. Uh, and there's a few other just absolutely busted game uh, game mechanics and everything else. Hopefully they're finally fixing that. Hopefully they're finally working that out. Um, but I really don't see characters. I think this is probably going to be just a pure maybe balance patch because it has... We, we should be getting balance patches a lot more than we're getting them now, and we should be getting balance patches before we get more DLC, right? Like, they shouldn't be doing a balance patch every four, three, four months with DLC. 
So I definitely think that they understand that at this point, and this could be a balance patch, the first big balance patch for MK Ultimate. Now, is that 100% the case? I do not know, of course. All we know as of right now is there is an update coming possibly next week. Again, this is not confirmed. We do not have dates. We do not have Mortal Kombat 11, uh, the game, or Ed Boon, or Derek Kirksig, or Tyler Lansdowne, or anyone else giving us an official update as far as a date goes for this. This is on the Steam of page and based on what we know uh, from previous experience as far as what the thing knows from previous experience it does seem like this update would come out within the next week or two but again nothing is confirmed when it comes to that and we'll just have to sit back and wait and see but hopefully we should see an update soon and i will keep you guys updated about everything i'm updated on but that's going to do it for this video guys i hope you guys did enjoy remember if you did enjoy the video make sure to actually like the video and if you want more mortal kombat videos like this make sure to subscribe to the channel i really appreciate it and also i want to promote my discord i do have a new discord it is 18 plus but if you are under the age of 18 you're more than welcome to join but just know that uh if you act like a child you will be kicked from the discord and there are some adult conversations going on in the discord we're trying to keep it as mature as we possibly can and just have a good time and uh, talk about video games and fighting games and mortal kombat of course i also want to give a huge shout out to my supporters ysm dino the thinny sir d mask of x pc Frank the Tank H2O and Ricky Laughlin. You guys are fucking awesome. Thank you guys so much for supporting the channel. I hope everyone else enjoyed the video. I've been your host. My name is Tootin. Y'all stay safe out there, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.